Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I sure appreciate you stopping by and you got here just in time. Today, I find myself at Lake McMurtry in Oklahoma. currently on a journey up to see some family in Wichita, Kansas, and I needed a waypoint stop. So I got to looking on the map, and I found in, in Oklahoma, right outside of Stillwater, Oklahoma, Lake McMurtry Natural Resource and Recreation Area, west entrance. So today I find myself at Lake McMurtry in Oklahoma, the Natural Resource and Recreation Area, the West Entrance. So we're gonna take a little ride. We're gonna do a little virtual ride through on the West Recreation Area and the campground. So let's go check out Lake McMurtry West. Get the camera seated for you. All right, get out here on the road. And now we can Cue the music. All right, we're not gonna be going too fast on this. Hold on. Gotta verify that the camera is working. We are rolling and we can cue that music. As I was saying, the roads here are, are pretty rough. So we won't be going Full little red speed. Well, not entirely. There are two different RV loops here at Lake McMurtry West. We'll visit the smaller one first and finish up on the larger one. Now that's the park office and they also sell minnows there they have bait and showers are located there now the campground actually the whole recreation area it's a dump station and a boat wash station so Lake McMurtry is owned by the city of Stillwell Oklahoma and the parks, the recreation areas, are operated by a third party vendor, a nonprofit organization, Friends of Stillwell. So they take care of everything here. And if you're looking for a good place to make a charitable donation, a tax deductible charitable donation. They are looking to add some, make some improvements. Primarily in the area of the, uh, for the disabled, the ADA stuff. This, this park isn't real ADA friendly right now. And they're, they're working on changing that, but since they're a nonprofit, they gotta have some funds. So if you got a little extra and you're looking a place to donate it, they would be most grateful. All right, this is the little RV campsite, camping loop one through six. And as you can see, it is a gravel road. which is really rough. But it's really pretty. These are water and electric sites. There are currently no full connection sites.
most of your RV sites are lakeside. So you have, you have trails leading down to the water. Just don't get in a hurry on these gravel roads. All right, they have, a, they have quite a few tent camping sites as well. Big group pavilion here on the left if you are looking to have a rally or something, family reunion, day use picnic areas. These are just restrooms. There's no showers. The showers are located at the park office. You can make reservations online. They don't have a, a, an attended gate. More tent camping down in the brush there. Now there's great fishing opportunities here. So if you have a boat, there are two boat ramps, one on the east side, one on the west side. Not sure how well it's going to come through, but right down there is a fishing dock. It's actually a covered fishing dock. And then here at the boat ramp, there's a second fishing dock. On our left, that is your swim area. Not so much a beach, but it's a place to get in the water and go swimming. We're coming back around on the back side of that restroom facility. Now if you were to come straight in the gate, and go straight past the main office. This is the road you would be on. Here's the map. All right, we're gonna swing through another tent camping loop over here. Well, I, I call it a loop, but it's more of an area. Tent sites one through four, there's no power, there's community water. But if you're driving a van, a B, that'd be a great place to spend the night. This is a, this is a fantastic waypoint campsite, campground. It's only about 20 miles, maybe 20 miles off of 35 north of Oklahoma City. All right, and this is the second camping loop, RV campsites, seven through 14. So there's only 14 RV sites. Of course, you don't have to worry about anybody hot riding through here because uh, it's, it's a pretty rough gravel road. All of your RV sites are, are gravel pads. Ours is, is pretty level. I didn't have to put any, any blocking under the wheels to get us level. This would be my preferred site right here. I didn't know what I didn't know. The site number 11. We're actually in site number 10 here on the right. I do have water access, but it faces the wrong way. So if you're gonna get into site number 10, my recommendation is to pull in nose first in your motor home. That 
brings us to the end of our virtual tour of Lake McMurtry West. Man, those are always so much fun. It's, they're more fun when I can go full speed, but you know, you do what you gotta do. Hey, if this is your first visit to Dude RV, I sure appreciate you riding along with me. And if you haven't already, I'd be honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. And for those of you who have been following along, thank you. I'm very honored by that. And for my patrons, you rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?